Hey guys, and welcome back to Shadow of the Colossus. We're not quite where we were. We were actually at the temple because we just defeated the uh, the last Colossus. Uh, obviously, that's <clears throat> what we do in this game. However, uh -huh, I started recording this episode and Windows decided it had to restart my computer for a Windows update. Um, so... <laughs> So I've lost uh, all of that recording because, you know, Windows updates are far, far more important than anything the user is doing. Uh, so, yeah, unfortunately, uh, I have lost that. Luckily, all I did was leave the sanctuary and um, get our asses over to here. And I believe the next Colossus, uh, because I did actually get to the area, but I haven't seen it, although I know... I have a rough idea what this one is. Um, so, let's go do that. Come on, Argo. I know, it's been a bit of a weird day, and uh, you may be having some deja vu. Also, I believe I mentioned that I got a laptop to help with recording and whatnot. I actually sent that laptop back because <clears throat> it wasn't quite what it was advertised to be. Um, Argo, there you go, buddy. Come on. Uh, also, <laughs> I got the uh, the trophy for doing all of the horse tricks. Um, what the hell they moved the trophies to now? Uh, for getting all of the horse uh, tricks somewhere. Uh, of course, all the trophies we've unlocked will be at the bottom. Uh, yeah, there you go. Trick Rider. Perform all stunts with Argo. Uh, unfortunately, again, due to Windows and Microsoft being a bunch of fucking assholes, um, we, we didn't see that. Um, but, you know, there's nothing special, really. Uh, the tricks are quite tricky to pull off due to the game's RC controls. Anyway, yes, yeah, so uh, I brought a laptop <clears throat> just to help recording and uh, whatnot and streaming and all that good stuff. Uh, but yeah, it wasn't actually what it advertised to be. Um, when I bought it, I think, yeah, we're going the right way, kind of. Um, it was advertised as a Pentium, a dual core, a Pentium Gold, I believe. Which was fine, you know, for what I wanted to do, for what I wanted it to do, it was fine. But there was something funny about it, I don't know, it was a bit weird, it was very slow and sluggy, blah, 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 blah. At times, start off okay. Um, so I went into the settings, and I found out there's actually a cellar on, and I was like, wait, oh god, hello, can we not, we must be able to get out this way, yes, I was like, hang on, right, a cellar on ain't really got the balls for what I want, yo, Pentium would have done it just fine, um, <clears throat> so I took that thing back, and I ended up uh, getting a Lenovo one. I was paid a little bit more money. Not massive amounts. Um, and I managed to get one of the uh, new i3 laptops. Uh, with a SSD and all that good stuff. So, you know. And it's quite interesting, actually. If you spend, like... I think the last one I brought was, was 320 which isn't a lot of money for a computer. But if you just up that to 400. Uh, well, not even 400. Because this one was technically on sale. But if you just up from, uh, say, 320, 330. To, I think this one was four, uh, 380. So if you just add, like, an extra, you know, uh, 50, 60 quid. You get a much, much faster CPU. Uh, and an SSD. It's um, quite impressive now how how cheap laptops have become. Now you know I'm not, I'm not saying 400 quid is not a lot of money. It you know it is. But um, the last laptop I bought was about 10 years ago. It was a HP laptop, um, 17 inch one. So it's quite big. Uh, whereas this one's a 14. I uh, specifically wanted a 14 because I didn't want anything too big. Um, and I remember you got so much junk with it, paperwork and all this crap, and it, it I think it was dual core. Yeah, um, an Intel Centrino, if you remember those things. 
and it was shit for the lack of a better word. I mean, it was alright. It, it, it did everything, but it was very slow, stuttery, and all that kind of stuff. Um, and that was about 900 quid, 800 quid, 900 quid, something like that. Gotta be somewhere around 10 years ago. Um, whereas for less than half that, this machine is, is crazy. It's so interesting to see um, how far technology has come. Anywho, let's keep going. Because we have a beastie to slay, and my phone is lighting up like a Christmas tree. God damn it. <sighs> right, hang on. Let me just mute everything. I've got like phone beeping off, bloody computer beeping off, bloody laptop going mad. Because everything's running off the same account. There we go. Mute everything. And I've got the. There we go. Why have you come to a stop, my faithful horse? Well, at least you're better than Sparkles. I mean, you know, I think we can agree that Spark, as horse um, loyal companion steeds go, Sparkles was pretty rubbish um, in our Red Dead Redemption LP, of course. Um, well, Undead Nightmare, anyway. So, this is as far as I got. I know, I did actually get up here. Yeah, because we had a little cutscene. This is as far as I got before I noticed my computer was restarting. So, well, 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 what do we have here? Wow, this looks fantastic, doesn't it? Oh, man. Oh, this game looks so clean, so vibrant. I mean, yeah, the texture work isn't, like, amazing. I mean, it's good. Don't get me wrong. It is very, very good. But it's not like, um... You know, it, it, it's still got a very flat look to it. It's no real uh, tessellation or anything. But everything just looks so razor sharp and clean. Look at this foliage here. Like, these places have been long, long forgotten. Oh boy. Oh boy, have we got a jumpy jig to do? Wander up. Argo, you can't follow me here, buddy. I know. I wish you could follow me. It's getting dark here as well, which is... Slightly worrying. That's fine. Everything's fine. Are we going up or are we going down? Let's go up. I don't like the idea of going down into that murky water. Um, you know, last time we was in water, um, nothing good happened. You know, we had a winged beast to slay. Uh, which was actually a, a heck of a lot of fun to kill that thing. Whereas, ooh, do we have any fruit here? No. No. No, we do not. Never mind. Let's go back down. I guess our destiny waits beneath the waves. Although there aren't really any waves here. This is a, a very flat pond, which which would be fantastic for taking the boat out on, you know. Um, hopefully, going to be doing a little bit more of that this summer. My friend has a... Oh, God! Uh, that's fine. Uh, okay. My friend has a boat, and uh, we go out in it quite a lot. He's got to give him the boat for free as well, which is interesting. Usually when you say, oh, my, my friend's got a boat, blah, 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 blah. Like, oh, guys, you, mu you must be loaded. It's like, eh, not quite. <laughs> we got the boat for free. Um, yeah. Hopefully getting a new engine for it this year. Mm-mm-mm. Looks like whatever we... Uh... Ooh. Now that is pretty... That is very pretty. Right. Okay, so this one's going to be slightly awkward. Oh dear. How the... Ch oh, there he is. How the frick are we going to get on this? Under the waves. How the bloody hell. Ah, it's kind of surfacing. Do we have to grab these zappy things? I'm going to go on a limb, guys, and say these zappy things are going to be uh, a little bit on the unpleasant side. 
which is a little ass Fortnite version, blah blah blah. Nobody cares about Fortnite. Oh god, here we go, here we go. In one second, guys, I need to pause. Yeah, sorry about that, guys, got interrupted. Right, uh, oh, ah, oh, shit, okay. Well, now how? Oh, hello, so its tail comes out of the water. Hang on, isn't. Okay, how the fucking hell? This is like some giant eel thing. So, how, pray tell, are we going to grab onto this thing without it drowning us? I suppose. Did we actually do the test for science to see if we um, would get drowned? Or did we not do that? Do we drown when our bar runs out or do we just auto return to the surface? Um, I am getting the feeling that that is a crucial bit of scientific research that we have not done. Uh, which is, under the circumstances, a little bit awkward, but uh, hopefully. Wow, that thing is cool. Really cool. I wasn't expecting like anything like this, to be honest. I mean, I kind of knew of this thing. Ish. I know some of the Colossi, because obviously, you know, you, you can't escape every spoiler. But this thing is cool. Okay, I don't know how we're going to get into this bloody thing. We're going to have to, like, head it off. Because we can't... I, sh I was going to say, jumping is actually quicker than swimming. But then you have that annoying sink into the water thing, which... Maybe physically accurate, but uh, god damn it, physics be a harsh maiden. Uh, right, he's coming to the surface. I really don't grab onto the Colossus' tail. Yeah, yeah, no, no shit. I think I could. Just about have worked that out. I'm just trying to. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Just trying to, uh, you know. Oh, 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 yeah. There we go. There we go. Uh, no, are we? Wait, it is R2 to grab. Right, why didn't he even attempt to grab onto it? Do we have to grab onto the... Ah, hang on, in the middle of it there was, like, hair. <clears throat> um, tufts of hair. Which, I guess, is what we're supposed to uh, grab onto. And not just the scaly bits that we can't hold onto. Which, you know, makes sense. But my cat is meowing. I can just about hear him. Yes, Stubbs, thank you for your input. It is it is noted, honestly. Right, actually, if we stand here, or swim here, I should say, the tail should, should, come on, baby, come on. Ooh, yes, there we go. Run, 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 hold. There we go. Boom, baby. We're swimming with the fishes, kind of. Well, actually, not really, kind of. We we are swimming with the fishes. Uh, hopefully, we're not going to be drowning with the fishes. Uh, that would be a little bit more awkward. Oh, God. Oh, God. I see how this is going to work. We're going to have to just, like, run a little bit whilst we're... Oh, shit. Okay. And then he goes up. And then down again. No, he's standing up for quite a while, actually. Um, right, can we run, 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 run? Ooh. Okay, I don't want to risk it anymore. Bugger! Okay. Oh, the other thing that I can't remember if I said or not, but... Um, uh oh. Yeah, when the video, like, failed to record... I did come across two shrines and get some more uh, uh, tails. So, yeah, we have like a tiny, tiny, tiny bit more grip. Run, 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 run. Oof. <sighs> okay, okay, this is good. Uh, not seeing any doohickeys yet. Run, 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 duck. So if I was a stabby point. Where would I be? Run, 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 run. Is that a stabby point? Ooh, that does look like a stabby point. Oh, shit! On a shovel. That was not fantastic. That is a stabby point. Okay. Um. Ooh, that shuts his... 
electricity off as well. Uh. Oh, okay. Maybe not a proper stabby point then. Because uh. it only hurt him a little bit. Run! Run, 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 run. And stab. And... Ooh. Okay, I was not expecting the stabby points to be this small. Can we get him again? No, that is disabled. Okay, cool. Alright, fair enough. Oh, shit. Shit, he's getting angry. He's getting angry and he's becoming drowny. We do not like him when he's drowny. Uh, buddy. Hey, bud. Could, 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 could you... Uh-oh. Uh... Okay. Okay, right. So if we lose our grip, we just auto return to the surface. Okay, that's not bad. We can work with that. Okay. Auto return to the surface. He's only got one zappy thing back. And um, it doesn't appear to be able to hurt me. Which is good. I thought like the big thing with this guy would be the drowning danger. But I guess, I guess you can't drown in this game then. That's actually... Incredibly useful to know, uh, you know, given the circumstances of of, of our dire situation here. Um, hey, bub, you you gonna come and pick me up? I need to kill you. And the only way I can kill you is, you know, by you coming and oh oh, you do not do that to me, sir. No. Stop that, you big bastard. Uh oh, oh god. Can I have some tail action, please? Ooh, there, there we go. There's there's the hit of the whole tail, I suppose. Okay, so now we've just got to run up along his body again. Uh, ooh, he's twisting. He's twisting in the water. He's trying to do one of those alligator death rolls, which, you know, I can't blame the guy for, in all fairness. You know, he's he's well within his right to do these things. Oh, God. Now, buddy, if you just let this happen, okay, just, just let this happen. You're not going to throw me off, my friend. I am going to kill you. Okay, I don't want to do this, okay? The gods are making me. Yes, yes, I appreciate it. I sound like a crazy. But it's true. Now, I say gods. I mean, we don't, we don't know. It could be a, a little boy with a megaphone uh, hid somewhere in the attic uh, of that place. We don't know. We're not privy to such information. But for now, we're going to assume that it's all powerful gods that... Uh, we are obeying. Oh, God. Oh, shit. On a shovel. Hey, buddy. Don't zap me off, please. I need your soul. Oh. Is it around? Oh, no. Oh, you son of a bitch. Come on. Don't, don't, don't. Be cool, man. Be cool. Good. Whew. Okay, that was... That was awkwardly close. Oh. There we go. Okay. So he does have a stabby bit hit. There we go. Oh shit. He's gonna get angry about that, you know? And rightfully so. I would probably be angry if something was stabbing me in the brain. Oh shit! In the brain box too. Uh, oh you bastard. Oi. No. Well, at least this ride was free. All we had to do is lose our best friend. I s oh shit. Put the sword away, friend. Put the sword away. Okay, 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 you good, you good, you good. Grip, man, grip. Oh, uh, this is going to get worse before it gets better, guys. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Yeah, nope. Couldn't quite get that sword into brain action. Come on. Uh, God damn it. We're going to have to be extremely quick here. Oh, that's the hit of the whole fruit right there. Look, matey, let me stab you again, and it'll all be over, okay? There we go. I'm reckoning two more stabs, and we'll be out of here quicker than a two jiggles of a jackrabbit's ass. Come on, boy. No, 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 no. You don't want to go down, my friend. You ain't going to survive forever. Ah, you bastard. Now I've lost my grip. Look, you're only prolonging the inevitable. You stupid beast. You majestically beautiful stupid beast. God damn it. 
All right, Wanderer. Don't worry about it. We can we we can make this happen. I think. We we still have all the cards close to our chest. Do we though? Do we? Is this guy just leading us into a false sense of security? I might have to say that so far this is the easiest guy. I think that we have fought. Unless he's going to get some weird, like, eyeball laser or some shit towards the end. Which, I don't think he will. Oh, his eye changed colour. What does that mean? Does that mean he knows we're here? Not that he seems too bothered. I mean, you know, he, uh, if anything can be said about this this, this chap, he, uh, he faces danger head on, you know? Like, no shits are given whatsoever. He's like, come at me, bruh. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? And I'm like, I'll tell you what I'm gonna do, buddy. I'm gonna stab you in the brain until all your black goo sprays all over me. And I am left back where I started with another fractured soul question mark. Okay, run, 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 run. Well, this chap is nothing if not predictable. Come on. Come on, poke your little head up. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Oop. Duck. And my cats are circling. My ankle sharks. They're circling for food. Run! Run, 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 run. Boink. There we go. Come on. Come to daddy. Come to daddy. Daddy loves you. Daddy just wants your soul add to my collection. What is this now? Number seven or number eight? I'm not even sure. Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good. Run! Run, 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 run. Hey, buddy! I need to stab you in the brain. Ugh. And it's gonna... Ooh, you sod! It's gonna... Ooh! Jesus! Where are the sick bags? Okay. Okay, he doesn't like me being here. I think I think he has a problem with what we're trying to achieve. Um, you know. Oh, you bastard. No, you son of a bitch. Okay. Okay, we're going to do this the hard way. All right? I wanted to do this the nice easy way. You know, this would have all been over by now, my friend. All been over by now, but no. Nope. You had to make this awkward. And now you're going to drag me underwater, so I'm going to fall off. Come on. Brain stab. Oh. 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 Dear God. Yep. There we go. Come on. Yes. Well, jelly deals tonight, I think. Waves of lightning. Although jelly deals. Ugh. <laughs> oh, that makes me feel ill just thinking about it. Well, another majestic titan destroyed, vanquished, if you will. Where is your soul leaking from? Bring out your dead. Oh, well, technically we, we bring the dead out. How the hell do we get out of here? I think we're just going to wait to absorb his soul. Uh, I suppose in the meantime we can we can get our swim on. I suppose. At least we've we've discovered. There we go. That you don't drown underwater. That is a really useful piece of information. And here we are. Another fresh victim. I guess we could call these guys victims. You know. That is technically what they are. A lot of them don't really seem that hostile. And this is getting creepy. <sighs> I'm getting tired. Damn it. Another one down, guys. Another one down. I love the way they come apart. It looks really satisfying. And it sounds good, too.
tail trapped within a pail deep within the forest. A shadow that crawls on the walls. That doesn't sound good. Sounds quite worrying, actually. Hmm. Okay. Trapped within the forest. Uh. Hey, hey, Argo. The forest that's down here, apparently. Intriguing. Anyway, my friends, I'm going to leave this episode here. When we return, I guess we're going to the forest. So, thank you very much for watching as always. And as always, till next time. <laughs>